guys and welcome back to my channel so this is my December empties video I did accumulate quite a bit of empties this month so let's get right into it so my first empty is the plum and plum Moscato and almond harvest with shea and vitamin E shower gel by Bath and Body Works this was really nice I got this in uh, the fall time uh, Keynotes, Pum Moscato, Toasted Almond, Black, Currant, Lily Blossom, and Vanilla Woods. That's what it smelled like. It smelled really good. It was nice. I would repurchase next season. Uh, this little guy has got to go. My bat sponge. He's all used up and all gone. I already purchased another one. I finally finished my first hand soap. It is the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin uh, Deep Cleansing Hand Soap. This had the beads in it. Um, I don't know if I'd purchase one with beads again. I do have, I think, a couple, under, I think one under my sink that has beads. But um, I've been purchasing, purchasing them without the beads now. But I finished it, yay. Would I ever purchase it again? Yeah, for the fall. Um, I finished Tums. I got the Tums smoothies this time and peppermint. I really, really enjoyed these. Um, if you guys don't know, I have a stomach problem and Tums at night help my stomach so this is what I was using and I have another one. I finished a uh, oh my god, shaving gel, the Skin to Mint, it's Strawberry Tangerine Twist. Oh, what does this smell like? This smelled like something and I can't remember what it was now. It um, maybe like a strawberry smoothie or something? It smelled like something I've had before. I mean I purchased whatever is there. Um, I always do it with a coupon so I finished two shampoos by the Pantene Beautiful Lengths. Finished two of these. I already repurchased more. Actually, they ended up discontinuing this line, or at least the conditioner and the two-in-one. I don't know about the shampoo. So after I finish the ones that I have under my sink, then I'm probably not going to get these anymore because they've been discontinued. But if they weren't, I would repurchase. I also have two conditioners. Same thing goes. They discontinued the conditioners. Um, I like this a lot. It I don't I feel like my hair is getting clean and it's not stringy and knotty, but they did discontinue it so I can't buy it again. Uh, but if they didn't I would repurchase. I have a deodorant, the degree motion sense shower clean. I don't know how I feel about this. I still feel like I get a little stank. I know it sounds gross, it's TMI, but from this, so I don't know if I'm gonna repurchase. I might try. I think it's called Shore. Ellie is for living, uses it, and I think I'm gonna try it. She suggests, she, she, oh, listen to me, all tongue tied. She suggested it, so I think I'm gonna try that next. I have, oh, I have two shower gels in here. This is Pear and Cashmere Woods uh, Autumn, and this has Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel by Bath and Body Works. This keynotes are Barlet Pear, Cashmere Woods, Creamy Fig, Jasmine Petals, and Sheer Amber. This smelled really good. I would purchase it next fall. What else? I finished Makeup Wipes, the Clean and Clear Makeup Dissolving Facial clean Cleansing Wipes, Oil Free. Instant instantly dissolves dirt oil and makeup, even waterproof mascara. I just had a coupon. That's why I bought these. In the end, I didn't really use them all. I ended up spilling some makeup on the floor, and I had to use this to clean it up. But this did a very good job cleaning the makeup up off the floor, I do gotta say. But uh, would I repurchase? I mean, if I had a coupon. I have a VO5 Herbal Escapes Moisturizing Conditioner. I use this, as you know, to shave my legs. Um, I think that my job, I think, is getting rid of these, which makes me really sad because I don't know now what I'm going to shave my legs with because CVS sells this for $1.29 or $1.99 and my job sells it for $0.99. Cents. So I think I'm going to have to stack up. I think I might have to go in and stack up on these. And yes, I would repurchase. I finished my Neutrogena, Neutrogena Extra Gentle Eye Makeup Remover Pads. Um, I use these to get makeup off my eyes. I've never had a problem. They don't burn my eyes. They don't sting. They have the extra gentle and the extra soft. I get the extra gentle. The extra soft is too thick for me. I don't like it. I like these better. What I ever purchased, I already have. And last but not least, I finished an Urban Decay De Sleek Makeup Setting Spray. The oil control, sorry about the decoloration. Um, I really enjoyed this. I already purchased another one on Black Friday, actually. And I just get the travel friendly one 
for no uh, no specific reason. I just feel like if I get the full size, it's gonna go bad before I can finish it, just because I don't wear makeup that involves a setting spray as often as I would like. I usually just will do right now just like a wing liner and some concealer to cover up some things, and that's about it. And so, what I purchased, I already have. And that is all in here. It's all empty. <sighs> well, I think I accumulated quite a bit of empties this month. What about you? What do you think? Um, but that is all for now, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. I would greatly appreciate it. And that is all for now. Until next time, bye.